FrameMaker 2019 New Features. Save as PDF Quick Start. In FrameMaker 2019, we've rewritten and relocated the options for saving PDF files. New and existing users are likely to look in the file menu for the Save as PDF options, so we've left that previous menu command there for ease of use. However, choosing this option displays the resulting dialog, which gives you a hint as to where the PDF controls reside. The dialog shows me the current settings for Output Location, Settings File or STS, and that the configuration can be done using the Publish dialog box. This command may be all you need once you've set PDF options appropriately, but as you see, the Publish pod now contains most of what we want to customize the PDF output process. I'll cancel this for now and look at the Publish pod. The Publish pod displays the document currently ready for processing, the current settings file, and the location for the output. The settings themselves can be edited by going to this button here, Change Settings, and choosing Edit. In the dialog, I'll choose the Outputs option, Confirm PDF, and you can see that I have a series of tabs related to PDF output. If you've created a named preset for PDF for FrameMaker or other applications, you'll likely find its name in the preset name list. If not, you can choose a more generic preset like high quality or standard and set the rest of the options as you like. If not, no worries. You can use the default values or set any options as required by your workflow. Marks and Bleeds, Security, and two tabs for data output are also available as needed to address those specific workflows. If you don't know if you need these, skip these options for now and come back later if you need to change them. There are two important things to keep in mind. First, if you'll be using FrameMaker's excellent PDF electronic document review features, you'll want to create tagged PDF. Also, the controls for both tags and bookmarks are document-specific options based on styles. So to specify either tags or bookmarks, we need to save and close this dialog and go to the Format menu. By choosing Save or Save and Close, I've updated my currently available settings file, which is something that I saved for my own use earlier. The document-specific Bookmarks and Tags controls are in the Format menu, under Document, PDF Setup. Here you have control over which styles are converted into bookmarks, and you can also adjust the bookmark level for nesting within the PDF navigation pane. You'll notice that there are two tabs for the tags. One is for the previous Acrobat Distiller workflow, and the other is for the new, more modern PDF engine. Both will satisfy the tagged PDF requirement for electronic document review and commenting, but the new tags feature also allows you to map to Section 508 compliant tags, further enhancing your 508 compatibility. As I mentioned before, the options in Format, Document, PDF Setup are stored with the individual document. Specifically, they're stored within the document properties. Here's a pro tip for advanced users. If you maintain a document template for your projects, set these options in the template file so that you can import them as needed into your other documents using file import formats. For more detail on individual PDF processing options, see the separate video, PDF Workflow Changes in FrameMaker 2019. For a personalized demo or questions, please write to us at techcom at adobe.com.